Hello and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Planet Zoo. Um, today we are going to be uh, working through the Great Caldera Safari Park. Um, so last time we got to Silver on the Maple Leaf Wildlife Park. Once we've got through all the scenarios, I'll probably go through and redo these ones. Uh, I've been playing quite a lot of um, franchise mode um, offline, so I'm a bit more familiar with all of the the features and how everything works so it should be a bit smoother now um, certainly more capable of building some cool things so um, so yeah Great Caldera Safari Park built on the site of a long dormant volcano Great Caldera Safari Park in is Bernard Goodwin's Ode to Safaris featuring animals from all over Africa which happily roam their expansive habitats the park is currently in a state of development with some attractions only half complete are you the right person to take them over the finish line well I certainly hope so because otherwise uh, this isn't going to be a particularly good video uh, a couple of offline follows. Uh, Link Math, thank you very much. And Jamie Donut 28. Cool. Um, yeah, this is just uh, streaming this just now. Um, the intention is for this to go up live uh, tomorrow morning on YouTube. Um, and that will be a regular thing. We'll be one of these every Wednesday. Um, but I'm streaming Twitch Rivals um, later tonight. Um, so we just wanted to make sure I could get this, this done. So this is probably only going to be about an hour video. Hoping we can get get through as much as we can in this as possible. Yeah, we have we have animals fighting already. That that's great. Yeah, we need to finish up our ride. Wonderful. I think I figured out how to do wides on it on the other one. Uh, so don't need coyote. Don't need for deal. Oh, we'll keep in Dali. Okay, fine. Right, let's get those. Get those gone, and we don't have a workshop in here at all. Get that workshop built. Uh, there's no animals fighting. We have quite a lot of giraffes, which is awesome. And that's really cool. So let's. We've got quite a lot of people in here already. So, what, what other animals did we have? We've got some African elephants, and we have an iguana. We've got a bunch of zebras. Bunch of giraffes, a couple of hyenas. That one's gonna get into a fight, so let's just uh, get rid of you as well. And then a bunch of sprint box. Okay, that's all. That's all fine. Okay, so release one of any habitat to the wild. We've already done that. Build transport ride with a super long length. Okay, so let's uh, let's be editing this. Uh, can we just auto complete this? I feel like that's that's fine. Is that long enough? I wonder. have at least 1600 guests in the zoo. Well, I'm sure we can we can manage that. All right. So on this station how do I edit the station again? Okay, 
yeah, that's fine. So that's that can do that can do that for the time being. So now we just need to get some more some more guests into the zoo. I guess we probably don't need to do too too much to do that actually, because we've got quite a good quite a good zoo going on already. We've got quite a lot of uh, quite a lot of nice animals. That's cool as well that it's going underneath there. Which gives them plenty of space. Yeah, that's that's all looking fan dabby dozy. Nothing can go with them. Uh, is there anything we can? Uh, let's work on some marketing. Because marketing is obviously a, a reasonably easy way of getting people into the park. Um, and our entrance costs are kind of expensive. Let's just tweak those a little bit. And then we need to work on our guest education as well, just so people are enjoying the park a bit more. Yeah. Zoomed in just a little bit too much. Um, right, so we want one of these bad boys. Ugh, I hate when it does that. It's like, put it where I'm actually looking at. This is dead, so we'll need to. Oh, I guess there's not going to be an easy way to get power out to there, is there? Unless I put something kind of. There's power there, so I guess what we can do is we can just extend this path. We can extend one of these paths wherever it will let me do it. And get a transformer as close to that point as possible. Transformers have slightly more reach, so as much as they're they're worse for people, I think I would rather have a transformer to make sure we can reach that. So that should then be powering that, which is beautiful. That can also be like the the path toward whatever habitat's going to be going to be here. Um, I don't know if we have any any animals in storage. No, we don't. So we could get some get some lions. I think we'll probably be the plan at some point in the future, but not just now because they are notoriously expensive to feed um, and that's something that I don't really want to be want to be having to deal with it yet um, yeah, spring blockers are in here aren't they so we could uh, we can put some African buffaloes with these guys can't we so let's do that makes these guys happier apparently however that works but Let's have a look for a couple of couple of decent African buffalo, and I want them to be I want them to be breeding. So let's. Uh, why are you not going to show me this? Or is it? Uh, I want to see the fertility gene. So that is a very fertile male. So he'll do perfectly, and she'll do perfectly. Where is our quarantine? There's our quarantine. Send that one there and send. Uh, 
send this one here too. And then they can go in with the with the giraffes and spring box. As a start, right, let's have a look and see what what the guests are are thinking about. Um They're not spending a whole amount of money. Are people going on this yet? People don't seem to be, or they seem to be coming to this side, just don't seem to be getting on from the other side. So, where is. I'm assuming this isn't the entrance. So, oh, that's kind of cool like that. Oh, we can't save it, that's a shame. And that's all reasonable looking. I think I didn't change that thing, did I? Let's sort it. I totally know what I'm doing with this. I don't know what you're on about. Okay, the buffalo are ready to leave, so let's get them into here. I'm assuming there is a, there's nothing pregnant. So we're definitely going to have to find some some money from somewhere because there's like nobody in here. Quite a lot of people are trying to get on it from this side, which is good. Right, how much are we charging for this? Uh, let me let me see. Are we not charging for this at the moment? That would be a that would be an interesting interesting choice. Tickets are twelve bucks. So, why is this thing not making a making a profit? Is that a bug, or is that? It's like this thing is making no money. It's like there's people getting on it, and we're not making any money. Makes no sense. No matter. Right, we are hemorrhaging money. Why are we hemorrhaging money? Are Staff wages are high. Okay, so we have too many caretakers that are good. Um, let's get rid of a couple of these guys. Like 3,000 a month is a lot. Mechanics, that's just one per area, isn't it? Yep, so. Uh, security guard, let's get rid of one of you. The vendors are probably all needed. Uh, let's get rid of the spare vet as well.
Okay, hopefully that that means we're not losing quite as much money going forward. Because that's obviously that's a massive discrepancy between how much we're making and how much we're we're paying out. So hopefully that that sorts some of that. Um, right. Okay. Let's see what other animals we can we can get and see if we can get some more people in that way. Again, don't want to put in a line or anything as much as it would it would help. Um, I feel like that's just too too expensive. Um, their their ongoing like food cost is quite high. Um, so can't really justify that, I don't think. Giraffes expecting offspring is good news. That's really good news. That should uh, on a zebra. A hippo could definitely go in for some hippos. That's a female hippo. Can we find a male hippo? Five hundred and thirty-three. Yeah, let's do that. Let's try hippos and see if that's that might be beyond beyond our budget, but oh dear. Oh wow, this entire thing of water is not not looked after. That's clever. Um right, let's let's go and deal with that. Like what kind of uh stupid start is that? This is a mess. Like, how are you? How are we expecting to sort this? All right. Let's just go with they're gonna fix that, and it's not gonna be an issue. It looks looks filthy as well. It's like, oh, look at this water. It looks looks clear. It's not just full of disease. That is pretty damn bad that there is a uh, nothing to deal with that. Stop trying to edit stuff. not really anything I can do with it about that apart from drying it all up. Maybe I'm supposed to do that. Let's do that. Why won't you let me remove the water? Water. I don't know if it's because there's an animal in the water or what, but let's uh, move you out the way so I can try that again. Wonderful. Uh, 
Um, yeah, there's literally nothing I can do about the cleanliness and that. It's just too too much, too much stuff. Yeah, you're just gonna find diseased animals everywhere because there's literally nothing I can nothing I can do about this. If you're not letting me get rid of the water either. It's like literally the only, you're diseased as well. You're diseased and expecting, oh, stop it with all the, ah. Why is it so much disease? This is a, this is a really stupid design. Can I like raise the, Doesn't let me do anything with the water at all. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to deal with this. Um, it's like even if I put in all of these things, like it's going to upset people because they're going to have to see them. Because there is no other way around these. Like they're going to have to be able to see these damn things to be able to to fix this. All right. Let's see. Let's just see if we can fix the issue first. Yeah. Let's just. If I put that one somewhere about there, that would do the job. You are not obstructed by it. Oh, you're still a bit. That's still a bit high. And then there needs to be another one out here somewhere in the middle of this. Nonsense, so let's uh
wow, that's sealed as well. Perfect. Just trying to make my life awkward here, aren't we? Right, okay, that that should cover all of the water now. Oh, there's a tiny little bit missing. Can we move this one? That then covers it all off, right? Yeah. Okay. As much as people aren't going to like seeing them, I really just don't want to have to deal with like trying to remove this water or whatever. So that should that should sort it. In theory, yeah, we know everything's a disease risk. We're we're currently working on it. Yes, we know, we know. Let's go in. Oh, we are hemorrhaging money again. Why are we hemorrhaging money? It refunds and it's not even refunds. Dire an extra couple of vets because everything's diseased. We need to need to sell some animals, eh? Let's just uh, let's just crack on with building our hippos. Well, yeah, it would be obstructed, but like, come on, figure it out. You kidding? You're not actually gonna let me build that? You won't let me build it ad hoc. Well, that's just a pain, isn't it? Okay, fine. Hippos aren't included in that nonsense then. That seems like a complete habitat, as much as it's all over the place and absolute chaos. Um, let's... Put in a habitat gate here and they can join it from... can 
dump the dump them in quarantine, then they can go into this exhibit, which should be more than more than sufficient for them. build a bigger bit of path to come out from here so people can walk out and see them. Let's raise it actually because it's a kind of right yeah yeah right no no come on there we go, that's what I want. That's what I want it to look like. And that's exactly what I want it to look like, actually. Okay, giraffe, are you, are you done being sick yet? No, okay. Fine, if that's the only thing that's sick left, though, that, that's okay, that's a start. Let's off one of these because that's a little bit more money. Ooh, elephants expecting, that's good. Highlands litter, for God's sake. Uh, we probably, let's just fire all of these and just have people randomly wondering about I feel like that's got to be a better got to be a better route and let's try and pay them as little as we can let's uh, let's open you up well, let me change it to 225 about five bucks a month I want it not you soz pal Right, keepers are also just too good. Let's just sack all these keepers and get some cheaper ones because it's a lot of money. Uh, let's just get four keepers because we've only got four or five exhibits. So we don't need as many as that, I don't think. They're also probably don't need as much as that, do they? No. So. They can go down to a thousand and fifty, ideal. You guys are too expensive to again, let's just sack the lot of is and we can uh, hire some new ones. I'm gonna hire four again. Hoping that this will this will just sort itself. Once I've done this, I'm just going to put it to 1,050 as well. Cause I'm assuming that's the the same. 280 is fine for those. 230 is fine for all the people are working. Uh, you're on too much. Okay. Habitat 40. Uh, let's call some people to come and come and deal with it. Hopefully, hopefully that sorts most of the issues.
Okay, these guys have passed quarantine. Let's get them out of here and into their exhibit. How is this one looking? This one's looking fine. Let's change these to every month. Let's change. Let's just get these things looking, looking spick and span, and then we can start worrying about what we're what we're doing next. Um, elephants and zebras. That one's looking okay. Let's just get that happening like that. Let's get these ones sorted every month for those. Wonderful. Okay. Okay. It's all all good. Right. So we've got a handful of a handful of animals that are expecting, which is great. Uh, gives us some more more youngins to be able to get rid of. Uh, we should probably get another iguana. Actually, where where is your your exhibit? Your exhibit is there, and there is space for more. That's interesting. Okay. Let's um. Let's see if we can find you a male. You're a lesser. Uh, it's further up the list usually, isn't it? It's not sorted. Not sorted lists are awful. Um, okay, so let's. I only want males and I want the cheapest males. Oh, that's the wrong button. donation bin or three in here and we'll get the rest of those populated is what we can do uh, next we'd like to sort the hippos out actually 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 Right, so terrain, you're nearly good with. You need some more rock, so let's give you some more rock. Cool, that's all, all you want in your life. Hard shelter. You need some somewhere to sleep. And this is a hippopotamus. Um, let's just go for a standard shelter. I'm not too concerned about looks for this scenario, especially seeing as everything's kind of gone wrong with the way that it was uh, previously set up. So Not enough hard shelter for them. Obviously, they are freaking massive. Okay, they preferred preferred that one. Cool. Okay. All right. What else? What else do you need to make yourselves happy? See, look at that water. That water is looking so much cleaner already. You need some enrichment. Let me see if we have anything that will suit you. We do. Perfect. So let's pop this as close to the, the central point as possible. And we'll pop a couple of sprinklers in places. And then we'll put down a food trough. These can go over here because there's a obviously there's a panel for them to be able to view it there as well. So yeah, let's let's do that. Let's see if that sorts them out. 
looks looks all good. Um, they're still saying there's not enough space for shelter. Is there anything bigger than what I have? There's this one. That's what he wants. Does that mean we can delete this one? Does that keep you happy? Wherever you are, you've gone swimming. It does. If I delete this one, does that equally keep you happy? Or do you need multiple? No, you just want one of those. Cool. That works for me. Ideal. And then we need to pop down a couple of donation bins on here. Wow, there's some uh, some blur there. Holy crap! Wonderful. We hit we hit bronze at least, so that's good. Look at the look at the lag and the that's really bad. Yeah, we've already got. Donation bins there. We've got bins in most places, to be fair. Right. What do we What do we need to do? We need to release four of any habitat species to the wild, which we've already done a couple. Breed six new habitat animals of different species. So we've nearly got to that, and we need to increase the education. So those are all reasonably achievable things that won't take too much effort, which is good. Um, so that is the next task. Hippopotamus. Why are you standing there? Stop standing there. Come up to the viewing platform up here and come and come and look at the hippos. Which one is at disease risk? The sh this should be fine. It's all covered off. All of the water's covered off. So don't know why it's still it's still green. It's still being treated. Is that what it means? That's what it means. Okay, so it's not, not completely clean yet. Uh, so we just need to get the keepers cleaning everything, I think. Just make sure they're doing this slightly more regularly than they already were. And we'll be fine. And then as soon as these things are these things are pumping pumping out clean water. We will be we will be fine. So more diseased animals, how joyous. Well, at least we've already passed the scenario, so it's not gonna be these things are things that we can probably do pretty pretty easily. Um, uh, can you not show me that in that view or do I need to go elsewhere? Um, right, okay, let's put down a uh, uh, giraffe. Where's the giraffe?
Protest protesters can arrive at the zoo as much as they like. This isn't my problem. And there's literally nothing I can do about it. Ugh, for God's sake. Uh, yeah, everything everything's diseased. We get it. Go and just deal with the water, eh? If you deal with the water none of these animals get diseased that's that's basically where we're at and the water is just not not sorted yet for some reason Let's just uh, let it pass through this because there's nothing we can do until they actually just sort this stuff out. Keeper being requested. No, keeper. Go in. We have plenty of keepers. Why? Why wouldn't we? We have plenty of keepers. Do we need to get another couple of keepers? Just to make sure. Go and go and do some work. Clean up some mess. Some animals have matured. Well, you can you can get sold. Basically, is where I'm where I'm at with you. It was released to the wild. We need to do, isn't it? So need to release four to the wild, which is fine. diseased animals, how wonderful. Let's hire another couple of vets again, I think. Oh, did that, um, yeah, he did arrive, okay, it's fine. It's like we're making money again, so I'm, I'm okay with expanding the team again. We're going up the way, which is which is fine. That's all we really need. I'm just going to ignore all of these uh, these complaints of everything, and we're just going to start building our next uh, next habitat. And this one's definitely having no water anywhere near it. Sorry, we need to put in a, a gate. And this will be cheetahs, because that is what it tells me to do. It wants me to invest in some cheetahs, so we can, we can do that. That is no problem at all. So let's grab ourselves a pair of the finest cheetahs we can find. Or just a pair, it doesn't really matter, does it? So we're gonna take this one and we're gonna take this one. Um, everything else is diseased anyway, so I'm just gonna chuck these straight into 
straight into the, the habitat. What's the worst that could happen at this point? Everything's diseased, everything's not having a good time, so. Oops, we do not need to do that. We want to put glass in those though. That was what I was wanting to do. So then this habitat's basically ready for them. Springbox fighting for alpha status. Not for long, you're not. Uh, you're diseased. Why? Why would you? Why are you diseased? That's really awkward. You are very fertile. The alpha male is better though, so you are going to the trade center just so you stop fighting with it. Everyone else. Oh, can you just hold my filters for me? Like if I'm looking at something, I'm not just like, oh, I'm done. Let's release these two oldest ones to the wild just so we can get this one done. Um, adopting the cheetahs is underway. Uh, we can pop a donation. I like doing these this way. I can actually pull this. Uh, pull this toward the path. So people can see a bit better. Gives the guys a bit more room as well. And then we can move. No, no. Move this to the path. Which will be fine. And then we can set up a couple of learning boards or learning stands. for the cheetahs when they arrive. It obviously doesn't know that they're there yet, so it won't let me. So as soon as those cheetahs have arrived, we'll be able to get this one up and running, sorted properly. Can we pull this back at all? Is it gonna let us do that now that there's a path there? Oh, it will. Okay, that looks a bit better. And then, yeah, let's move this onto the path. There we go, sorted. Sorted just, just like that. Boxed outside of habitat for too long. Why, why are you stuck halfway? You're right, multiple animals do have low welfare. Go and deal with it. Right, cheetah. What what do you need? Hard shelter is sufficient. I find that hard to believe, and I think you're going to complain about this in a minute. But never mind. You want short grass, not long grass. That is not a problem. And that's all he actually needs, isn't it? So let's just uh, let's just do that. We can then, if we choose our cheetah friend, cheetah friend, we have we have this nice pre-built cave that I like the look of. Oh, pressing the wrong buttons. I like this. Um, it looks cool. Um, it's sufficient for their hard shelter as well. So, um, and it's not that much more for looking significantly better. Um, need a water pipe, need a food tray, and then, oh, we don't have too many enrichment items for them, so. And by too many, we have absolutely none. So we are gonna pop, 
let's pop a couple of these guys on some research and then get you researching the cheetah. And that should be you guys sufficient and happy, other than that you haven't got any, any food enrichment, but there's nothing I can do about that for the time being. So that should tick off that one. Got education raised, so we just need to breed another another animal, which is which is fine. And this thing needs to have a mechanic, and this has got a keeper on the way. Okay. Okay, we are we are making progress, slow progress, but we are we are getting there. And what are the what are the the gold ones? Release eleven of any, breed eight new habitats. Increase education, increase ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. okay. Don't think we'll do the gold again, just for time constraints. Um, I think we'll probably just complete the silver and we will we will leave it there. Should sort that issue. Yeah, that one's failing. This one's failing. These things need to keep working because as soon as the distance starts going down, that's when there's going to be issues on everything else. So dangerous animal has escaped. You're right. It ha it has. That means that I have not got my fences anywhere near tall enough. So let's uh, let's sort that. Do that, let's raise it to four meters. I think four meters should be sufficient. Cost a grand, that's quite a lot. Um, Zoopedia, what do you what do you need? Now you're not supposed to be able to get out, so it's obviously just this bit was just easy enough for you to walk out of. So let's just raise that bit a little bit higher as well it was obviously just a, a short short step for him to get over there okay so we've got silver we managed to get to that so yeah i think that the oh, stop speaking um i feel like these ones are going to be difficult to difficult. To, some of them aren't actually that difficult. We're not going to get to twenty eight hundred guests particularly easily though without getting the lions. Eh, we we can give this another half an hour. Give it another half an hour, and if we don't don't do it by then, we will we'll call quits on this one. But we will we'll try to get the gold. Where is the other? You have been captured. Move you back there. It's like I really can't do anything about all of these, all of this disease. Like this is a really poorly, poorly designed layout um, of this place. Um, but we are making enough money that it doesn't bother us too much at the moment. Um, can we? Let's see if it's gonna let if I'm like paused if it lets me do anything with this. No, it really doesn't. I was hoping that it would maybe if it's a specific angle. It's really annoying because I wanted it to be a uh, being able to go through the other bits, but never mind. It 
doesn't matter too much. It's not a particularly important um, zoo, so um, I'm going to cut this back across this water as much as I can and give them as much space to wander about this side as possible. And then if we pop in a habitat gate here. Oh, and then we need to reattach this. So. And then I actually just want to remove the water if it's going to let me. I don't know if it's something that yeah, it might just be something in the scenario that you actually have to have to deal with the water. I'd imagine that's probably the case. Um, right, okay, let's build a staff path to get some water cleanliness type things all the way over there. we can put a water treatment I don't know the water treatment needs to be even closer water treatment needs to be there if it's not there it doesn't cover everything so then we'll put a transformer next to it and we'll just join them up to the what we're doing there we go that's fine this is plenty big enough so let's go and find us a pair of lions hey 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 okay um what can we what can we dispose of One of those males will give me enough so to buy two, so let's just whichever one is the least fertile is the one that's uh, going. You and I guess we can get rid of one of you as well, because don't need as many as that and it'd be good to make sure I've got enough money to be able to buy these two lines. So that is a male and that is a female. Okay, that should be, that's everything kind of a, a stable, stable place now. For these lions to arrive. Which then gives us that one. Um, we can release, we already released a couple there, so hopefully that updates. So that may be including to that. And then, yeah, basically as soon as anything is old enough to be able to move on and it's not diseased we're just going to get rid of it I think like these just don't need these spring box at all Let's just release them just get that 
up and going. Hopefully some, some less animals will uh, help the, the issues with the, the cleanliness and everything as well. Still don't get why this is still being treated. Don't go near the water. Okay, so other than everything still being diseased, which we can't really control. Um, oh, African wild dogs, stop, stop fighting. Don't do it. Um, I guess we can just release those, don't need them. Oh, habitat cleanliness is disease risk, oh, you, no kidding. Okay, I think we're making enough money. We can hire four more caretakers. I'm gonna hire some more mechanics and more keepers. Try and keep things at least partially stable before everything goes completely tits up. Hire a couple more vets. And yeah, we already hired the mechanics. Did we hired more keepers, we didn't hire the keepers. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Cool. That should be fine. Hopefully, they deal with stuff. High amounts of litter isn't a massive issue, um, other than we're not going to get to our twenty eight hundred with that going on. So. Elephant has had offspring. Yay. Can I just like build more more water treatments? Will that fix the issue? That should hopefully do this quicker, in theory. No idea how that actually works, but we're gonna. What are you? What are you doing? You're fighting over incorrect sex ratio. Oh boy. Where are my spring box at? Just go away, annoying little children. I actually kind of just don't want any of these, but let's just release those. Stop them being, uh, it will stop them being diseased. How are you diseased? Why are you, why are you diseased? That's just not even funny because that's the the wrong area.
Okay, disease has gone away. These these new water treatment facilities are doing the job by the looks of things. Only had to place four of them, you know, but whatever. And I want these visited every month just so they don't cock up because it's obviously very important to this lake. And uh, what we actually forgot to do was put any bins down, which is why they just don't seem to. Oh, can't put it on a hill. People, stop! Stop throwing litter. Right. Right. Water should not be a problem. Uh, where are my lines at? These things have been sat there for ages. Customs seizure. Sure. Geek Yen, Geeky Ken, sorry. Uh, thank you for the follow. connected. Ah, uh, the path's not connected, that's why they can't actually drop them off. I made a silly assumption that this path was connected. I've messed up this path. Try and do that. Never mind. There we go. Right, now you can get to get to this and drop off my animals. Why has that not got an actual proper barrier? Please, let's let's actually have a barrier there because I don't want my don't want the lines escaping. Alright, you need some more short grass and some more rock. All you need, you need some hard shelter. We will our West African lion. And let's just have I got any other ones that I liked? Yeah, this one might be too big for here. Need to actually sink this one as well. Yeah, that looks about right. That should give them plenty of hard shelter. Then we're just on some food tray, a water pipe, and some sprinklers. Because again, we don't have access to anything else yet, so that will have to do us. So we have that, we've got 1700 people in the zoo. Uh, we need to breed something else, we need to increase the, um, everyone's educational stuff. So let's, let's pop another, one of these bad boys. And let's put this for West African Lion. Let's put in some...
and then you can learn all about them up here. There's already a bin, which is perfect. May as well put down a recycling bin too, just to make sure people aren't dumping rubbish. And let's pop a couple of donation bins in the middle, and we're still still dragging some stuff there. That, it wasn't doing that before, so that is uh, that is definitely new. New and unwanted, but never mind. Let's just chuck another one in the middle here as well. That should be okay. Let's chuck another couple of recycling bins down. And we can chuck down another one of these. Hate this it never actually makes sense as to where it actually is uh, African wild dogs with a couple of speakers to talk about them Get this, try and get this growing a little bit more, shall we? Water treatment failing, water treatment failing, solar panel failing, vet research complete. Hopefully this is cheetah, it's not cheetah. Okay, so yeah, this park's like uh, the zoo, the zoo, I keep saying park. The zoo's starting to starting to take shape, starting to look a little bit more like a zoo. Um, obviously the bits I've thrown together have been quite hasty, so they haven't they're not as uh, nice as the the bits that were there in the first place, but there were a lot of issues. Um, the, the water was one of the main issues. Um, so at least that is that is sorted. Diseased animal discovered. Oh, joys. Thought we were, thought we were done with this. Is this the cheetahs? No, it's the other one. Okay, let's push another 10 minutes and then that will be, that will be us. And then we can, fi I'll finish that off sometime offline. I don't think we're gonna be able to push this over the line with what we currently have without like some miracle of baby lions or something, like drawing a lot of people. Let's get these people coming off of this a bit quicker. Because everybody seems to get stuck at this side. So if I do this, hopefully it will speed that along a little bit. Okay, at least we know about that disease now. So we've got that going for us.
it's like no one ever seems to get on from this side so I'd rather we try to get people into this side of the of the park yeah that's better now people aren't sat on the ride waiting or sat on it waiting for us to get off many guests think tickets are underpriced I don't think there's any message that could have come up there that would have made me more happy would love to charge more uh, financial wise we are back in the back in the uh, what is it the black it's all good making lots of monies Good. It's all all starting to look okay. Cheetah's hungry. Um, okay, someone come and feed the damn animals. Um, right. Well, I'm gonna build another another set of uh, staff facilities here because they've obviously not been not been using them particularly well. So let's just pop this down here A workshop you can build up and um, because we're in challenge mode um, the points are just incrementing every minute as far as I can tell uh, I did see that uh, a couple of minutes ago and I was wondering what it is but it just seems to be each in-game day, it just goes up by one. Um, so that's what causes that. As far as I can see anyway, I, I, I'm not sure if there's there's something else going on there um, that, that does anything with that, but that's what I could see that would kind of make sense. Uh, certainly in this play mode, it would make sense that you would just accrue points. Um, certainly wouldn't make sense in, in the other play modes. At least there's now some more facilities over here that they can use. Which all looks good. Where where are we at with this? We're up to one point six for education. I guess we can just put some speakers in here, couldn't we? talk about giraffes let's put one up here one over there one in here uh, let's talk about giraffes let's talk about buffalo and let's talk about uh, there's a spring box I think we're in here so that one's not powered can we move that one so it's powered It's fine, it's not the end of the world. Right, the same with this station actually. Let's stop this so there's a max wait time of 10 seconds. Just get these people flying round. Let's get them flying round as soon as it's full. Off you pop. Um, okay, hopefully this is our, still not our cheetah. I guess I should probably be researching the line as well because that will, uh, everything's failing, wonderful. Let's go and get some mechanics to go and look at these things. Are we shy of a vendor? Okay, let's get a couple more, a couple more staff on the go. If there's issues with that, I'm not sure why there's. Just hire another four. Yeah, I've just been running through challenge mode to kind of uh, have a little bit of uh, something different. Everyone else seems to be going for franchise, um, so I figured it would be more interesting, something a bit different to, to try and try and do this for everyone. So, right, okay, everything's looking okay. Everything seems to be stable, other than obviously all of our things about to explode. 
Fire a couple more mechanics just so we can get around these a bit quicker. Cool, they're all sorted. Perfect. There's a springbok about to mature, I'm sure it said, which means they're going to fight. Because that's apparently all they want to do is fight. Oh, it's a female, so that one's fine. Uh, let's check the, the hyenas as well while we're while we're at it. There are two, so we're just gonna get rid of one just before they start fighting. As much as they haven't been. Oh Latif is a good one. We're not getting rid of Latif. Come on now. Come on now. What about Mwamba? Ah, Mwamba's not as good. We can get rid of Mwamba. Okay, cheetahs, perfect. Cheetahs have been finished, so that means that we can, should have something to be able to give to a cheetah. And likewise, they tend to overlap with the, with the lines a little bit too, so. Just a scratching pad, it's just a scratching pad, but yeah, we can pop that in the lines enclosure as well. Should make them a little bit happier. Yeah, they're happier on their toys. Just need some food enrichment, but that will that will come with time. Guess we can feed these guys a little bit better. Don't want to do it too much, but I'd like these guys to be the. We've already got that one, so we're just trying to get the guests up. So I guess that's at the point where we can actually uh, put the marketing back on. Money isn't really an issue now, so let's let's put the marketing back up. Oh, well, dogs. Or is it for an alpha male, alpha female that they're fighting for? No, I obviously just looked at the wrong one earlier. So, uh, release those guys. Off you pop. Thanks for coming. Uh, so I need to keep increasing this education rating. So let's. What exhibit is this? This is the spotted heightness. Okay, so let's put up some more more education stands. Spotted hyenas, and we can put on some kind of speaker. I like putting them up here. Actually, it's kind of kind of cool because they're out of the way. I can put them quite loud, so they go quite a, quite a distance. That one's been damaged, so that's why that's like that. Uh, I guess that there is I don't know why we've not got a big path coming out from here, so let's do that. get some extra stuff on here. put some more we've got a much better view from here so this should be this should be a lot better actually actually let's try and move this if it'll let me click it it's not gonna let me click it for whatever reason 
move that and put it on the back of this. Talk about elephants, make it super loud so everybody can hear, be educated about it. Um, and then we can put some bins in places, make sure there's no litter. And then some donation bins around here. And then I'm going to put a couple of recycling bins around the sides as well. And then you've got a much better view of them over there, like that. And you can be able to see them down there, you can see them over there. I like that. Let's let's try hope that hope this increases it a little bit. That decreased it, apparently. <laughs> um sure. Okay, as much as we're we're kinda close to this. Obviously there are still issues with various habitat cleanliness and all sorts in this um scenario um so yeah i think with another a little bit more a little bit more time um we would uh, we'd complete this one but just for the sake of um trying to prepare for the event that i've got on tonight so this is oh what is this scenario called let's call it scenario five i believe so Thank you very much, everyone, for watching. Um, I'm running a couple of giveaways at the moment. You can see links to them um, down below. You can type exclamation point giveaway in Twitch chat uh, to see and enter those, um, which would be awesome if you can do that. Um, but yeah, that's everything for this one. Uh, I might follow up with this one and finish off all of these that I've got to silver at some point, but they're quite time consuming to do. Um, and obviously, I just want to keep, keep playing new things. So um, thanks very much, everyone, for watching, and we will catch you next time.